Good morning tank friends. Well I got the tier 2 engine for the VK3002. Hopefully it's got a bit more, you know, pep to it now. More vroom, more torque or horsepowers or whatever it is the cool kids are talking about these days. I don't know what they're talking about. Probably something about horsepower. The main thing is, more horsepower, lighter weight, and I think less chance of being set on fire, which is always useful. But, Wargaming gives you one hand, and it takes away with the other, putting me up against tier, like tier 8 tanks. Yeah, there's, there's tier 6 tanks, and there's tier 8 tanks, and there's nothing in between. Well, oh, the engine sounds beefier, or is that just my imagination? Have to go back and compare. Mm, here we go. Feels like it does accelerate a little more quickly. Actually, it's, it's got a bit more oomph to it. It's not so sluggish on the, the getting up to speed. Oops, on this ridge, ridge riding, ridge spotting. Now I'm going to go for the hill. I don't know if I should, especially in this game. I mean, up against tier 8 tanks, what the hell, Morgan? You could at least give me some tier 7s to shoot at, but no. Straight into the tier 8s. So this is a weird match. Well, anyway. Let's hope it's good. Oh, IS-3. You're not that slow, can't I? Sort it out with your funky pike nose. I have got an IS-3, I should hardly ever use it. I'm so afraid of... Every time I play it, I'm up against huge big ass tanks that just destroy me. It's so rare that I play a play games in those tanks that I don't get to play as the top tier very often. Oh here we go. Holy crap, three of our team are dead already. What went wrong? Well that was lucky. That he must be well, I can do something to the Ferdinand, at least. Screw you, Ferdinand. One of the many benefits of being on the hill is... Oh, one of the main downsides of being on hill is that you are going to get shot at and hard. And there are two SPGs who are going to be hungry for kills. Can I get a cheeky, cheeky shot on this guy? I think he's around there. No. So it's nice three. We've got nice three. That's all right, see. That's that like Ferdinand I was shooting at earlier, isn't it? He must be like, oh, it's not fucking. Ah. We're dead for well, there you go. Mistakes were made. Mistake number one forgot to pack consumables. Remember, kids, always bring consumables. Mistake number two um, not being cautious enough, I think. I could have been a bit more careful. I should have been a bit more careful. I think I was a bit demoralised at the start by going, oh, look at all those tier 8 tanks. Like, if I stayed alive longer, I could have put more shots into the Ferdinand, into the AMX. I mean, the AMX, one of the AMXs has died. But there's still another one. Look. Biding his time. SPG is signing. New plan, book it. I don't blame you. At least he's not going to go and drown in the lake. I don't. river thing. I don't think you could actually drown in that. You'd have to try pretty hard. You'd have to just kind of roll your tank over, I guess, and just give up. Now, looks like they actually took the hill. I think it's a little too late now. I don't think there's going to be much to be had from this. Let's look at... Uh, where's the Egg Panther? There he is. Uh oh. It's the K-1. 
curse of death. If I look at anyone, I'm gonna die. Oh. Nasty. <clears throat> Who's next? <laughs> Who's next for the gallery of death? The tracks are up. The tracks are repaired. He's going in. An AT-34 is a cool looking tank. Maybe I should try the American Heavies, actually. I mean, it's a nice shape. I like the turret. It took me a very long time to get to tier 8, though. Okay. Here we go. What? Server. Server bad. Maybe you can drown in there. <laughs> they will find you. They will Liam Neeson the crap out of you. Well, this is a... I hope everyone else's morning is nice. You know, this is. Someone said, "Hey, how are you spending your Saturday?" I said, yeah. "Watching a M40, M43. Enjoy the Riverside view." 914 crash. Maybe his computer crashed. No, I've not had any problems actually. Normally, every time it's a patch, something for me goes wrong. But 9.14 has actually been remarkably stable for me. I don't know what. What are the odds of that happening? Oh, come on, one shot. You can do it. Uh, well, there you go. 